you found our Life and Money newsletter. Welcome. It's something special. We built this for a reason, and it's not because there's a shortage of financial literature already out there. All over the world, if you ask people to describe the way they're feeling about their relationship with money, the word they use is anxious. We've got more news, more apps, more fancy cool kid toys, more books, more podcasts than we've ever had before, and people are still feeling anxious. You'd think these things should help, but they haven't. It seems like it's not getting better or easier. Yet in our ongoing work with clients, the most common things clients say to us is, I wish we had met you 10 years ago. We've marinated on that for some time now. In general, people feel anxious about their money. And at the same time, there does seem to be some opportunity to reframe how we think about our life and our money. So we decided to address that gap. Over the past few years, we've started to write down the things that we would have said had we met 10 years earlier. The gaps, the challenges, the different ways of thinking through the money questions. And that's what you'll get by email from us every few weeks. Another nugget, another way of thinking about your money, another thing you probably wished you had considered 10 years ago. If you're looking for hacks, tips, tricks, look elsewhere, my friend. This is about wrestling through the muddier parts of money. So welcome. You'll be glad you found this.